Hi, it's Matt Kendall here once again on a cold October. Yeah, it's October sometimes, it's cold, isn't it? Um, I'm here with Claire. Claire did her training a few months ago and she's just provided her case studies. And so today, hopefully she'll join the association and become a practitioner. So how are you doing today, Claire? How are things? Hi there. All good, thank you. All good. So we were just talking a little bit. You're a Bowens practitioner at yes. the moment. Um I don't really sort of know what that is. So I know I have worked with Bowen's practitioners to, who have done the training, just sitting down again. Um, so basically, what, what's a bit about your background? What is Bowen's and what are the kind of people you kind of work with at the moment? Well, Bowen therapy is a physical hands-on therapy where I'm releasing particular muscles or areas which are holding tension and relieving, and it works globally over the whole body. So helping people release their aches and pains and various tensions. And so so what kind of person, are you, are you working with people who've been through accidents or stress or what, what kind of people would kind of come to you for Bowen therapy? All sorts of people come for Bowen therapy. It's usually people who've got, I find lower back ache, headaches, often they're stressed. Um, they've tried other things, it hasn't worked for them or they prefer a gentler therapy that's not sort of cracking their back and things like that so I do get uh, all types of people brilliant and so we we're just talking there we know Robert and Jules and so uh, were you actively looking to learn other therapies had you heard about IEMT so obviously you were kind of told us so what was your introduction to eye movement to the IEMT work so I had heard about IEMT from Robert, as we discussed, um, and he mentioned that it was a simple to learn technique and that you don't have to have a therapy background to do it, um, but it has really clear results. So I started to look into it and came to you and hence I did the course. And so far mm. it's been really interesting. So you did the course because obviously you have done other training, obviously you did all your Bowens training, stuff like that. So the actual course itself is a two-day course. Um, the week before, I send you out all the information, there's videos, there's manuals. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, then you then go do, you do the weekend, and then you do two case studies, which we'll get to in a little bit. Um, and then you can obviously use it, you can use it, you can integrate it with what you're doing, you can use it kind of standalone. So what was your experience going through the course and what did you think of the materials that were sent out beforehand what was it like going through the course and what's the aftercare been like as well so i joined the course quite late i think there was a cancellation so i received um all the instructions um there was a bit of homework to do just to make sure that you had questions and things to work on through the course it was two days on zoom really enjoyable good fun um thoroughly enjoyed it very clear had a particular structure we went through all the different things with the two days mm -hmm. um and we broke off into separate rooms to practice with each other everybody on the course was very supportive and um it was in very enjoyable afterwards we had um some more like um, a pack that we received after the weekend which showed us how to do the case studies um, I practiced on lots of people um, and then I worked through the case studies. It's all very clear. I didn't feel at any point I didn't know what to do. And if I didn't know what to do, Matt was always there. You can ask questions. Um, the manual was very good as well, very clear. Nothing too complicated. It was just learning it as it was laid out and then practicing it with people on people I find, even though you're doing it clumsily at the beginning amazing that you get results straight away so it's very encouraging so overall and, good and so let's talk about sort of results because some people have got no idea what what results actually are <clears throat> so when were you surprised that from because the first couple of hours of IEMT training uh, is me talking about uh well, everything in like no about the actual structure and you know the, the patterns of chronicity and everything and then basically from like one o'clock Saturday onwards, it's very, I'll teach you something, I'll show you something. Then you go do it in a practice room and then we review it and talk about it. Were you surprised that you were able to create change within somebody and within yourself, basically straight off the bat? Definitely. 
So in the course, I was a guinea pig because you demonstrated on each of us. Mm. Then I felt it, how it felt to have that change. Um, and that was really useful to have had that. So I knew what the, um, the people who I was practicing or how they would feel. And yeah, the changes, you can feel it at the moment with the eyes moving. You can feel it there and then. So I was very surprised. That is a, a strong change quite quickly. Yeah. Yeah. And and because you get to practice every part of it as well. And I believe the more you practice and the more experience you have, the better therapist and practitioner it makes you. Because uh, I've been to some courses where they just show you that they, they don't even they just talk to you. They don't even do a demonstration. You don't get to practice and then they want you to go and do it, which doesn't kind of really make sense. I like my courses to be very interactive. Um, I demonstrate everything you know sometimes multiple times and then you get to actually practice them and, and I think what people are surprised about is like we're now doing that thing we've just seen and we're actually getting results uh which which you know and some people who have been doing talking therapy or stuff like that for you know like well it takes three months to get a breakthrough it can't take 30 seconds of moving somebody's eyes you know so um but the important thing is is it's not just what you can do on a weekend, it's then what you then go and do afterwards. To me, that's the most important thing. So I've been on some weekends, I've been a brilliant weekend, but I've not taken any skills away and I've not used it. And I found that to be quite the case for a lot of people. So with the skills, with the IMT, what was it like? Because I know you've been practicing with friends, you've been practicing with other people and doing full case studies. What's it like being going out and using these skills and what changes in your case study specifically have you actually seen within people? So the case studies were amazing. I had two people who volunteered um, to be a case study and both of them actually said it was life changing, which was amazing. So I was staggered at how quickly I got the results and I just applied it as I had learned it. Um, there's a little bit of kind of keeping it organized, but with that, the first session and then the second session, the results were really amazing and very quick. And when we talk about results without, well, no, it's, it's a case study, but we, we don't want to give it sort of in super confident details away, but what kind of results were you able to help your case studies to achieve? So what, what changes actually happened in their life? Yeah, so um, one of my case studies, she had um, a lot of anger and uh, how she reacted at home with her child and partner. She found relief of that anger and her overreaction. She found she was able to communicate with them um, with a much more appropriate reaction if there was an argument or anything mm -hmm. was going on. So, and she was absolutely delighted because it was something she couldn't overcome by herself. And another case study, she got results on being able to speak in groups, being able to speak on Zoom. She was very nervous about speaking, speaking out, and she got improvements with that as well. Brilliant. And, and what, what I really love, I was talking uh, to Mandy Bridge about this recently, actually, on, on Facebook. It is the ripple effect. So say with your client, uh, your case study, who was having, because of previous stuff, she was having a disproportionate emotional response to her husband and her child, to their behaviour, basically, yeah? yeah? Now she's got a much more proportionate response to this. Not only have you helped that client's life, mm. but her husband and her child. Now, if her husband's life has been changed, that will also affect people he knows because he'll be less stressed so it'll affect people at his work his family and his friends the child now because they're less stressed and less angry they might now be doing better at school or whatever it might be better with their friends less money. and that can then ripple out so you can work with one person but it can actually affect a dozen it can affect more than that as well so i always do think it's not just the one person you're working with you're working with a group of people you're helping by helping this one person by having better emotional control and mental clarity how that's going to basically ripple out as well yeah. so going forward 
I know you are a, a Bowen's therapist, but I believe that you want to, she sort of maybe combine a little bit, but do this more separate as, as well. What are you looking forward to doing with IEMT and what kind of people do you think you might want to sort of work with and what's, what's it sort of, what's exciting for you about taking this forward? So I'd like to work with people who have got issues in their life, maybe confidence, they're anxious, just to help them be able to move forward in their own lives. And as you said, if that person is less stressed, less anxious, they can, their whole family will improve. So I think that's the kind of person I, I'm attracted to working with. Brilliant. So Claire, there's some people who are watching this interview thinking, oh, I don't know whether to do this IMT course or not. They might want to go do something else or they don't know because what they've heard about IMT, it seems magical. It just seems made up. <laughs> you know, it's just like, it can't be true. Now, as you know, I'm not a woo-woo person by any means and I don't offer any form of outcomes. And I say it's an exploration of the problem. So for those people who are kind of watching, who are still kind of on the fence of whether they should invest their time, a weekend, Yes, it's not really expensive, but obviously it's, you know, it's a few hundred quid and stuff. Um, what do you have to say to people who are sort of considering it from your own experience, going through it, experiencing the changes and seeing the changes you brought in others? I would say definitely, definitely do it. It it does seem too good to be true. And I was amazed when my the people I've been working with, they had such good results so quickly. So even when you're learning, you're still getting good results. Um, obviously getting more experienced you'll be able to hone those skills and go forward with that but two two days out of your life to do the course which is really enjoyable and then practice 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 and you will be able to do IMT so it's definitely worth doing. Claire I want to thank you very much for your time today if people want to seek you out I know you don't have this website up but you've got your Bowen stuff if people need to be Bowen's back into shape where, where can they find you on the interwebs my website is called body symmetry cambridge and i work just outside of cambridge in histon um yeah that's it brilliant thank you very much for your time today thank you great thank you matt